Maryland Eastern Shore has to play a little bit of zone just due to only having seven scholarship players. Nice entry pass to Thomas on the back door, and they get the first basket. Through form, Justin uh, Robinson starts the offense, and they go down low quickly to Blackshear off the glass and rim, got his own rebound and put it home. Jones at the top, he'll hand it back for Ahmad Frost. And there's Jones from the long two-pointer just inside the line to give the Hawks the lead back by Virginia Tech. And yeah, Maryland Eastern Shore has had trouble getting off to good starts in games. Can't leave Blackshear open. He dunks it home. Now for Nikhil. He'll stutter step and drive all the way through and put it in. What a talented offensive kid. Just a halves of their games this year have the Hawks, so they would love to stay in it here for the first 20 minutes and then work from there. Nice jumper by Myron Thomas at times, and the Hawks jump into a zone to change things up on the defensive end. Out of the corner, there's Nikhil. That's the danger. It's there by the Hokies. Hawks had nothing going on. Robinson all the way through, up and under. Got it to go. Extending the lead. Pressure man to man. Alexander tries to go inside the defense, and then driving with a. Nice looping layup from Robinson. Frost able to maintain his balance there. And now Baycoat will dial a three. Dial up the long three. Robinson gets the rebound and a dangerous cross pass stolen by Baycoat. And he'll go back for Mod Frost and the layup. Able to get, get the shot up, got his own rebound after a couple of taps. And the lefty Bibbs with the long three. And again, offensive rebounds. Now four for Virginia Tech. In the corner, there's Frost, and he'll hit a three. So staying in it with three pointers as well, down to one with that. And there's a big steal. Justin Robinson will get the dunk. Back with more after this. So you look at the other side of that coin and the Hokies shooting 55% from the field. And Clark shows why there as the big man hits a three from the top of the key. Leandre Thomas coming in at the post position. There's Clark with the step back and he's feeling it to start this game. Five in a row from Chris. And the Hokies just shatter that. Devin Wilson gets the ball over to Clark. Is he feeling it? Yes, he is. Another three for Chris Clark. Lost the handle, Blackshear recovers, kicks it in the corner, and Beatty hits another three. Alexander Walker to Visa, jump Hulk, stop. Hulk showing a little zone. Gets it out to Alexander Walker, and another three, seven of ten now. He's skilled, very fundamentally sound, really knows how to play. High basketball IQ. And speaking of hot shooting, Alexander Walker, another three. Everybody's going to get a couple threes today. That one to go, but that was a nice move. Nukiel with the rebound. Leading the break in the corner. Long three for Hill. And they make him look like layups. They can shoot him so well. Bigger team in this situation. And the hook is hitting a lot of shots, too. <laughs> There's a nice block from behind there by Thomas, but Alexander Walker does get the rebound. And Morrissey's not listening to any of them. The right here and the left here getting worked. Nice backdoor to P.J. Horn from Robinson. Beautiful layup. To hold the possession. Devin Wilson, the utility guy, plays all five spots. And football last year, right? That's right. Good shot by Thomas there. Eddie player, unselfish, just everything you'd want. And there's a nice no look inside. And splitting a D is P.J. Horn, and now he's feeling it too. Jones on the low blocks. Nice touch. Nice play, Tyler Jones. Shows. And the entry inside. They find Ahmed Hill, and Chris Clark loves it. Ahmed Hill, physical inside, powers it home. 26 points now. Two math majors over here. Exactly. Byron and Mack. Ahmed Hill. Look at the arc he gets on his threes. Beautiful shot. Scoop pass to Clark in the corner. And here comes another three-pointer, and it's getting ridiculous for Ahmed Hill and the Hokies. 
Alexander Walker works his way through the defense. Kind of fake on that three and drive. Here comes Bibbs all the way through. There's Bibbs on the pick and roll with Blackshear. Goes all the way through, leans in and puts it home. Absorbed the contact. Was there when he walked back in. Blackshear low blocks, will turn and face. And power move against Thomas, goes home. Skip pass from Blackshear. In the corner, a long jumper is good for Justin Bibbs. Here another rebound. Chris Clark underneath. Reverse layup is good. Nice move. Kind of had to hesitate and go around the defender. Leandre Thomas the rebound. Tyler Jones, rather. He has a bad pass to Chris Clark. A one-handed pass up to the hill, and he'll lay it in. Heck of a pass. Heck of a catch. How much of that do you think is going to slow down once ACC, or can they keep it up? Well, the, the level of competition on a night-in, night-out basis. Baycoat, the long three, Ahmed Hill, the rebound. What a pass up to Clark, and he'll slam it with two hands. And what a great job of running the floor, recognizing the change of possession. Good execution. Baycoat trying to go one-on-one, -on -one and hits the jumper. First field goal of the second half at 9.52. Chance to run the team a little bit. Buzz loves that speed that he brings to the table, and Tyler Jones with an up-and-under move to put it in. Three on two break. All the way with Bisa misses the lay in with Ahmed Hill on the three and two running. And Clark will take it away. A little bit out of control. Whoa. It doesn't matter. He'll lay it in on the reverse layup and an and one for Chris Clark. Starting to become a staple. Look at that. He's getting bounced all over the place and lays it up and in. Out of the corner, a long jumper from New Keel again. And they're in a zone now themselves. Baycoat left open and they finally get one to go here. Only their third of the game. McIntyre.